don't know how much confirmation it could be, but according to a lot of the geophysicists out here, October 6th and 7th, which is the first day of Tishery, a super solar uh, storm is what I've been heard, what I've been reading, is going to hit the Earth on October 6th through the 7th. Uh, 3i Atlas. I'm going to tell you guys, there ain't no coincidence in things. Just so happens that the government shutdown happened right at the point where all of our telescopes could have seen it. Or do they not want to see it? Now, remember, there was a paperwork out there that uh, was supposedly leaked that NASA was telling its people uh, to be hush-hush about it. They knew it wasn't a comet, and the information was not to be leaked. But just so happened, a lot of you guys feel like that government shutdown was planned, which everything they do is planned. The argument about giving illegals benefits or not. But on the flip side of that, you guys, the, the, the government is shut down right as this stellar, this interstellar visitor passes Mars and we had the greatest chance to see it with the most powerful telescopes but just so happened since the government is shut down there is nobody to operate these said uh, telescopes mighty funny and there won't be another chance to look at it because it's going to be blinded or the earth's view will be blinded behind the glare of the sun do you find that a kawinky dink or no <laughs> uh october 10th i keep hearing that in my in my head about little catherine 2020 it's going to be a big disaster i keep feeling like that has something to do with these flares, earthquakes, and volcanoes because there are big ones jumping today. And I've been posting those as well. So I'm gonna put this one on both channels, but the government shutdown, planned or no? And why is it that they did it right as 3i Atlas, which means Elah, E-L-A-H, act of God, is about to be visible past you know right now as it's going past mars but after that you won't be able to see it all of these things happening this week coming it's not a coinky dink folk it is not you have the first of tishery october the 6th 7th the uh monday was the harvest moon and then tuesday right after that is the anniversary of yahoo's false flag at the border it's a big week coming up for a lot of things that, that's possible that could happen. So let's continue to stay prayed up that we are worthy of escape this trash that's about to hit the earth. I'm telling you, it is a big time deal coming up this week. Could this be our last weekend here? I don't know. I'm not telling you what's going to happen. I'm just showing you the alignment of everything that is or possibly could happen, okay? And let's keep that in mind as we continue to look up and stay watchful and prayful. Some weird things going on. Weird things. Them earthquakes, hey, let's just continue to stay prayful. Peace.